Okay, the verses in chance, very slowly. <laughs> Solo. I'm changing the sound here. I'm going for that chorus sound. I'm going for a high octave. It's more a sort of plucking harp sort of sound. It goes like this. Same verse part again. In the chorus. string, the open A string, and the fretted notes on the 11th and the 14th of the G, and the 11th and the 14th of the D, which is a Stuart trademark, so... <laughs> now for the guitar solo, I'm going to switch to the dirty amp. In the studio it's clean but live it's dirty so it's starting off on the 7th fret of the G. Switch sides from a high octave on, going back to clean up and I'm back to this. seen that part and then we get to the final uh, choruses and at the lead out and the heavy part and so on it's just the same chorus riff again some slight variations I'm going to switch the delay on for this one That's a D chord, I'm playing on the bar, but instead of playing all three notes there like that to get the D major, um, Stuart would normally just miss out that note there, so you get a... So often you'll hear that... You'll hear the ninth note coming in there, but sometimes it's just muted so you don't hear it. Now last bit I'm going to show you, it's, this is only really on the single version when it fades out. Uh, and I've heard Bruce play this a bit live, but it's just on the open chords. That's all the parts, so hopefully you can play it now.